Hello everybody and thank you for watching the video. Uh, we, in, the, in the past video we talked about uh, the reports of based on the condition. Right now we're going to talk about if we have bulk items which we would like to move within the system and those like 500, 200, 300,000 items that we want to remove from one condition to another condition. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to create the batch. So what is a batch? Batch is a you take a lot of the IMEIs and put it in one number so we can you if you when you move that one number it will be all those IMEIs attached to that one number will be moved. Either you make it from one condition to another condition, one department to another department, or one uh, attached to one order. Let's say, uh, so 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 let's say we have created a new uh, batch number. So first assign a batch number. Let's say we did one triple uh, seven. It's already in use. So we we already created the item, uh, the, the, the batch number, just the batch number. We go into the IMEI list here and we will say that we wanted to add IMEI to the batch number. So we'll just copy and paste what we did from here. This was the list that Windows Vendor provided us. This is the same list that we uploaded in the system. We'll just copy these uh, IMEIs and we can add it into a batch. So now we have four IMEIs already added to this batch 777. Now, uh, what we have to do is we, you know, we have to uh, make sure that this IMEA has been received. It's, if it's not, it's been received, but uh, we're not going to be able to move it in the system because those IMEA has to be in the system. So these IMEAs was not received first because we received 24 IMEAs and no, these IMEAs are in the system actually. So we can easily move them left and right. So let's go to the IMEA batch and it's already in the system. What we have to do is, uh, let's say I wanted to go to the testing, IMEI testing, IMEI batch transfer, I'm receiving, I mean, where is my IMEI testing here? In there, I will put a batch number, it's a 777777. This is my batch number. And I say that I will assign the whole batch as a Galaxy, as a S5, as a 16 GB, carrier AT&T color. Everything is, let's say, black. Condition is. A plus IMEA is clean, everything is working, we already checked it, and we're putting in the stock because we're gonna be selling it. And and the batch processing is not working. Okay, so we will we will we'll do the we'll do the seven 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 here and and that's it and we'll do go go and we will go and hit and save what what's gonna happen all these so what we're gonna do we will we will come down and we will and we will add the batch number and the batch number and we will we will save it and this whole batch with the all all of those four items um, will be changed to this condition as as per the as per the system so this is also uh, you know we can have uh, we have some characteristics of batch batch transfer we can also do a batch transfer which means like uh, um, you know we have the IMEIs in between there So this is this, these are the IMEIs and let's say pull up a batch number 4777 this was the batch number search and it will pull up okay these are the IMEIs and I wanted to I want to remove this IMEI from this batch and I want to move it from somewhere else but I have to tell them that where it's going to go it has to go to a, a different batch number uh, or we can also you know take it out from a batch but you know normally if you are moving it you're moving it out of a batch number so we will say that it will probably going to go to a different batch which will be let's say I have to find out a number I mean batch and here's my number triple four let's say it will go to the triple four triple four one two three triple four so now this uh, this IMEI has been transferred to a new batch. It's triple four, and there's only three batch, three IMEIs left. So there's a lot of things that we can do with the batch number. And also, let's say we have the IMEI fulfillment, which which means like uh, we have the we have an order number, and we uh, we you know we with that order number we can associate the whole batch, which means like if I say seven 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 here, which means whatever the items is gonna be in the in the seven 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 hundred five ten twenty whatever will be attached to an order number. Thank you.